Welcome lads, we're back for another video. Today we are looking at 80 rated Gaston Ramirez plays for Middlesbrough in the Football League Championship and also for Uruguay. And that's kind of really the first point of this player is he played in a really not that good of a league. Not too many good players. I'm pretty sure he's the highest rated player in the whole league. Yes, there's some quick skillful players out there i personally like this league there's a lot of good options there kind of hidden gems that aren't necessarily used but that's why his price is discard value for an 80 rated cam who's got very good stats as we've seen he's got 75 pace 80 shooting 80 passing 83 dribbling and 65 physical he's got medium medium work rates four star skill boost which is amazing for a cam three star weak foot he's left footed He's a tall player. He's just got it all. But that league is just going to bring him down. And he doesn't have like an amazing nationality. Like yeah, Uruguay has some good players. But it's not like the Spanish or the or French or English even. That has just a high quantity of players. So Uruguay's just got some very good players. But just not filled with them as it was. And the, the league just doesn't have the high quality players out there. And I feel that if you overlook that, you've got a very good player here who ma matches, for me, all the stats that I want in a cam. Someone who can shoot, can pass moderately well, can dribble, because he's, he's the anchor. He makes everything click. If he's playing well, probably my whole team's going to play well. But now, let's move on to some stats. Looking at his skill stats, he's got really good ball control at 84. Crossing is at 76. Don't really care about that. 83 curve with 77 free kick accuracy. He's got them free kicks on lock. 78 finishing. Not bad for a cam. I wish it'd be a little higher, but you know, he can't always have everything. 82 shot power. 81 short passing. 83 long shots. 75 long passing. He's got the heading accuracy of 58, which is a bit of a letdown because he's six foot. You know, he's tall, so you theoretically he could head the ball. But apart from that, the skill stats are there. Everything about him, it makes him just such an amazing cam. Can finish, can shoot from distance, can pass the ball well. Now, looking at his physical stats, he's got pretty good attacking and positioning for a midfielder at 81. Vision, 82. 78 acceleration. 71 sprint speed, so he's got that going for him as well. 73 jumping, he's not bad, but he's tall, so I don't really care too much about that. 83 agility, 61 strength is a bit of a letdown, if truth be told. I mean, he's, you know, it's all his height, they're normally a little bit stronger than that, but he's pretty agile for a player that tall, so he can get through defences pretty easily. I mean, I love playing with this guy. There's no getting away from this. Once I built my team and I had a good team to play around him, I was all in with this player. But now, let's jump in to some highlights. As we can see here, he picks the ball up just outside his own penalty box. Does a lovely little move to get by him. Uses his acceleration to get through, sprint speed, what have you, his pace. Here he's just doing a few little ball rolls. I think that's his third ball roll. Now he's out on the wing. Now, he's going to come inside. Oh, look at his skills. See, that four-star skills right there just split the defence. And he just couldn't quite get it on target that time but he was just such an amazing run here he just used the probably the most overpowered skill move in this game for me personally the ball roll it just cannot be stopped boom tries a long distance shot long distance shooting wasn't generally his uh, strong suit as he does a lovely little spinner there and that one had a bit more power for just wide and here he's just got acres of space you can't give this guy that kind of space he will tear you a new one here he just bursts through gets through and he you know, he doesn't score, but here again, he's just getting through. And you know, that was a good finish, frankly. He just went around the goalkeeper, just cracked it right into the back of the net. Here he's just dancing with him. He can't quite put it away. And as we bring an end to this video, I must say, I really liked him. Besides his league issues, he was great. But now, if you like the video, make sure to drop a like, drop a comment, Follow me on Twitter, at Wisdom, and make sure you subscribe so you catch all my videos. And I'm out. Bye-bye.